All right, so what is up, y'all? It's your boy, Legendary EA, back here for another rebuild. And before anything, as you guys can see from the title, we will be rebuilding the 2012 to 2013 Los Angeles Lakers. Now, obviously, I have done a lot of the Laker rebuilds, but for another episode of these historic rebuilds, make sure to go ahead and slap that like button, and let's get 300. And 85 likes for another one. Yo, keep on showing that love and keep on showing that support. Today is December 25th. Actually, it's Christmas Day. I'm, I'm recording this at night. It's it's it, it, it's uber late out here, y'all. But anyways, hope you guys did have an amazing Christmas. And make sure to tweet me what you guys got at on Twitter at legendary ea2. Make sure to tweet me. I would love to know what you guys got for Christmas and how you guys spent it with your families. But yo, hopefully you guys had a wonderful Christmas. Anyways, y'all, we will be rebuilding the 2013 Los Angeles Lakers, and we all know how that team went. Uh, Kobe, this is the white situation isn't getting any better. Why is that? Why don't you ask him? <laughs> Would you take Kwame back? <laughs> That'd be cool if we get him back. Damn, he's bad. Suck. Hey, get out of here. Guy, you know, you don't even smile anymore. Why is that? Um, Kobe told me to stop. They're gonna fire you. Hmm? What did you just say to me? <laughs> Come on. You know. I think they're gonna do it. I'll do you? <laughs> Kobe, now that you're injured, they're saying that it's all up to Dwight Howard. <sighs> yeah, yeah. Mm. we know, man. So, what do you think your chances are of getting out of the first round? Uh, they're going down, man. God damn, pussies. So, who do you think you need to win the game? We need Jesus. Oh. Shit! It failed miserably. It failed miserably. People thought that the 38 Steve Nash thing, the Dwight Howard thing, and the Kobe Bryant thing would work, but it, it was terrible. Now, I have had a lot of requests for this video, but yo, let's get straight into this reboot. En enough talking, enough of that intro, let's get it! So obviously we have Kobe Bryant here. I did find this roster on 2K Share, and I did edit it up a little bit. But here, Kobe Bryant, he should not have the afro, I know that. Don't, don't, don't leave that in the comment section, I know. But anyways, we, we got Dwight Howard, he was still good at this time. Paul Gasol, Steve Nash, yeah, that's about his same overall back then. I think it was like a 79, but now it's like an 80. But as far as the rest of the NBA, we got we 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 got some young bucks. We got Drew Holiday on the 76ers, Jennings on the Bucks, Noah D Rose. Was this a season? Was all right. This was a season he came back from his torn ACL, or this was a season he missed. Yeah, this was a season he completely missed, so he he shouldn't even be on the roster. Kyrie Irving, 86 overall. Paul Pierce, you know, as they're getting older. Chris Paul still doing his thing there. LeBron and D-Wade still running the NBA in the East. Kemba Walker is a rookie right now. Or is he in his sophomore year of the NBA? Uh, Melo is still hella cold. Uh, what else? Dirk is still a beast. Darren Williams is still a... Bro, Darren Williams was actually pretty good this season. He averaged 19 points. So, yeah, that's kind of on point. Ty, La Ty Lawson is still a beast out here. PG is still coming into his thing. Anthony Davis is a rookie. Rudy Gay is on the Raptors. Now, James Harden, he's on the Rockets. You know, he's, he, he's just waiting one more season for Dwight Howard. But my, primarily, but my primary goal is to make sure Dwight does not leave this time. This team is kind of messed up. But I know how y'all feel about me changing up these rosters. Y'all not messing with it. So I'm just going to leave it how it is. Uh, KD, I, I, I don't even know if if Russell Westbrook is, 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 is a 91 right now. Kevin Love is a beast. But, yeah. That's how the NBA was looking kind of in 2012. I definitely think that I can turn this team into a title contender. But let's see how, you guys already know how I am. Let's see how they do at the end of season number one. And let's see if this is going to be an easy or a hard rebuild. So at the end of season number one, LeBron is the MVP. Let's see, if this, is there anything else different? I didn't really check these rosters, but Miami won 70 and 12. All NBA first team does have Kobe Bryant. Did Dwight Howard make any of these? No. Come on, D12. Where, where, where you at? He didn't even make an all-defensive team. Really? Well, I, I I guess that's how it was in real life, right? So obviously, okay. What 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 what's up with what's up with these rosters? Let's let's take a look at it because I didn't really even pay attention to it. But no, what it's really it's whatever. We are already in this rebuild, but we did finish as the second seed. Uh, as far as the standings go, we were the second seed. We finished five games behind the Oklahoma City Thunder. What? 
and the Warriors were up there? Oh no. The Cavaliers were at the top. Oh my gosh. This is not looking like real life. But as far as points go, Kobe Bryant did average 32 points a game, 7 assists, 6 rebounds. He was killing a D12, 16 points, 12 rebounds, 2 blocks. Nash, eh. But anyways, that is the end of season number one. But let's see if we can actually win the championship because we do have a definite shot. That we're taking on the Denver Nuggets and Ty Lawson. I think we got this in the bag, or do we? Really? We lost to the Denver Nuggets. Okay, 2K. You telling me. You are going to, well, actually, this part makes sense about the Thunder in Miami because I think that happened in real life, too. But you're going to sit here and tell me the Kings made the playoffs and the Golden State Warriors made it to the second round in 2013. Okay. So as far as player mid retirement goes, Kevin Garnett retires in this simulation. I'm sleep because in real life, he just retired. Then we got Derek Fisher. Steve Nash is going to be leaving, which is great because he had so much cap room. And Steve Blake. But, I mean, it's, it's really whatever. But I think that we can win this championship in season number two. So, let's see what we can do. So, obviously, I did import a draft class. We, we, have, we don't even have a first-round pick. So, we have to make some moves here. So, let me show you guys this draft class. Anthony Bennett, Victor Oladipo, Otto Porter, Giannis, the Greek Freak. CJ McCollum. Okay, this is a this is a all right, all right draft class. Bennett is a B overall, but I guess that makes sense because even though we even though we know him as the biggest bust in NBA history, coming out of that draft, people thought he was gonna be great. So I do want to go after Giannis, and I still don't want to go after him. I want to go after Giannis, or just Giannis to be honest. That's the only person who I really want to go after. Yo, Giannis is a choice. Let's see, if we actually move into that top five. But other than that, we gotta we gotta make some moves here, cause right now this team is not looking too too hot. So we actually traded all of our picks, and now we have the number three overall pick. So let's hop into the NBA draft and let's see if we can make any moves at all. Hopefully we can turn some things around and make the playoffs. All right, I let's we don't need him. Paul Gasol thought thinks he's slick for accepting his player option, but he might not be returning. I, I'm 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 not gonna lie. Uh, you guys all suck, so I think I'm th I think I'm good here. I think I think I'm good here. So Kevin Durant, we can't get him. D Wade, we can't get him. Chris, we're, we're gonna get Chris Paul. We're gonna get Chris Paul. You you gotta go. I'm sorry. You 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 gotta go, Paul. Love you, but you guys you you gotta go. For two first round picks, I might just do that trade. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. Two first round picks for them from the New York Knicks. I think it's worth it. I I, I love Paul Gasol, but. I can't sit here and say I don't want to see him, him play with CP3. This should have happened in real life, but the NBA kind of hold it. No trade clause. And right now, it looks like we will be able to get Chris Paul. But I do want to, you know, offer Dwayne Wade. And K you you can never pass up KD. Now, my number one person I do want to get is Chris Paul. Steph Curry. Uh, if worse comes to worse. Ty Lawson, though. I really want to make this rebuild interesting. Ty Lawson would be an interesting get. And on day two of free agency, we will be signing Chris Paul. And let's freaking go. Anybody else? It don't look like. Okay, OJ Mayo, I'll sign him. Let's pick up all these guys. But we just signed Chris Paul. So Kobe Bryant is this big three would have been nasty. Chris Paul, Dwight Howard, and Kobe Bryant. I'm 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 not gonna lie. This team looks like it's championship, bro. Like it's championship bound, and we are able to sign Manu Ginobili. Let's freaking go! You know what? I I am done. This off season, we made so many moves. This team is winning a championship in season number two. So for the start of season number two, this will be our lineup: CP3, Kobe Bryant, Giannis, David West, and Dwight Howard. And our bench is all right. We got Manu, OJ Mayo. A lot of shooting yards so let's see if we can make any types of trades pick up some more draft picks and you know improve this bench so first off we're gonna trade away tony allen and let's let's oh yeah we got karan butler in this thing Let, let's see who we can get let's 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 do that okay so we picked up al jefferson i do plan on playing him in power forward because his overall should go up and it does buy one but that's the only trade that we that we will be making for this second season so for season number two chris paul kobe bryant Giannis. Al Jefferson and Dwight Howard in a bench. 
maybe not it may ask maybe not the last trade but let's see what this team can do at the end of season number two i did add jose calderon i just signed him out of free agency it was it was a lot easier than even trading for one and he's still not gonna even play but let's just see what this team can do at the end of season number two but the way this team is looking if we win a championship 2k just don't like us first time baby but i knew the day so give me the beat i eat and at the end of season number two, LeBron is the MVP again. <laughs> Anthony Bennett wins rookie of the year. Yeah, that would have definitely happened. Aaron Gordon, six man in the... Okay, whatever. We're going to ignore that. Uh, th these Ross, like I said, they aren't the best, but they are something for sure. And the, I guess Greg Hopovich is not in the game because he wasn't coach of the year. But Kobe Bryant is all NBA first team again. This time he's a 99. Okay. Okay, him and LeBron are dominating this league. All right, did Dwight Howard make a team this year? Chris Paul did. Chris Paul Chris Paul was putting up numbers, though. So did Russell Westbrook, 93 overall. And Dwight Howard does make all defensive second team. And Giannis makes all rookie first team. So it looks like we had a lot of, a lot of accomplishments. We, we went 60 and 22. Best team in the West by far. Actually tied for best because we did have the same records as the Spurs, but they did end up with the second seed. As far as the stats go, 11 points by Kobe Bryant, averaging 27 points a game, 7 assists. Chris Paul with 19 and 9. Dwight Howard with 14, 12 and 2 and a half blocks. But this team, we were clicking. But let's just see, because you guys, you guys already know how it goes. This entire thing means nothing if we do not win a championship. So let's see if we can actually get that thing done up against the Grizz in round one. We should be able to sweep them, right? And we beat them in five. Okay, see in round two. We take game one. We take game two. Say bye. Never mind. Say bye. Bruh. Say freaking bye. Okay, so we actually make it to the Western Conference Finals versus the Golden State Warriors. And the where's my Miami lost in round. Okay, this championship is ours. We we better not lose to Golden State. And we sweep them up against the Atlanta Hawks. Who the Hawks have in this year? I, I who who did the Hawks have? I don't know. I don't remember. Let's see. They had Ty. They signed Ty Lawson, okay, and they had Josh Smith. Josh Smith was, he was cold back then, and they had Lou Will. But let's see if we can actually beat them. I think that we can. They were the fifth seed. Let's go ahead and let's send this entire run. And we sweep the Atlanta Hawks, and Kobe Bryant gets his sixth NBA championship, and that big three came alive. So if CP3 would have won that, Kobe would have never gotten hurt, and they would have won that championship. And I'm saying that right now. But let's see if we can go back to back and get one more of them things. I mean, you know, Kobe, you know, he's still in his prime, kind of. No injury. No problems. So let's go ahead and let's get this man his seventh championship. But let's just see because we did use another draft class. For this draft class, they have Andrew. Okay. Yo, 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 yo. We might need to trade up. But last year, it didn't really work out for us. So... If we can do it, that's cool. If we can't, it's really whatever. But let's see if we can get a top two pick or a top three pick. I'm cool with that. Y'all willing to do this trade? Okay, so we have the fifth overall pick in the draft. Hopefully, we get who we want, but let's see. Let, let's see who's out there. So we did take Marcus Smart in the NBA draft, but let's just... Can I flip him, please? For something? And of course, we will be bringing back Al Jefferson. Okay, Carmelo Anthony's out there. We can't afford him though, but that would be nice. Uh, let's uh, yeah, let's just offer him a contract. Oh, let's go, let's freaking go! They come in so clutch. Melo, please come here. Yo, we might be able to get Carmelo Anthony if we get that. This rebuild, best rebuild ever. Chill out. We gonna win another championship. We are gonna win another chance. I'm we gon' whoever made the, this roster shouts out to you. You coming in clutch. You coming in so clutch right now. Um Alright. But we do sign Carmelo Anthony, Tony Allen, and Raymond Felton. And it looks like this team is gonna be going back to back. Cause that addition of Carmelo Anthony, we got Kobe Mello. The cold Mello. CP3 and okay G freaking G this team's won the championship but let's just see let's see who else that we that we can sign and then we'll just go ahead and start up next season so for season number three we got Chris Paul Kobe Bryant
Carmelo Anthony, Al Jefferson, and Dwight Howard. And then off our bench, we got Giannis, OJ Mayo, Aaron Baines, Tony Allen, Kevin Serpent. But, yo, this team is all right. We got Marcus Smart. But this team looks like it can definitely win a championship. We don't even need any trades. But, of course, I'm going to try to make some. But we don't really need them. And who else can we get? Uh... None of these is none of these guys are different mix, but let's see. But let's see if this team can go ahead and win another championship because I think that they definitely can. We have the best team in NBA history without any type of doubts. I'm a Laker. Yeah. Right now, crash later, cash out. And once again, LeBron is the MVP, so yo, that's Loki his award. Andrew Wiggins wins rookie of the year, just like in real life on the Charlotte Hornets this time. Uh, anything else? Willie Cauley Stein and coach the year is Eric Spolstra. How? I don't know because we had the best record in the NBA. So we honestly got hold right there. But Kobe Bryant once again is all NBA first team doing his thing there. And nobody else. Okay. No one else. That's what's up. But Anthony Bennett, my boy, does. <laughs> I don't know how this is going on. He makes all, all NBA third team. It's really whatever. Uh, yeah, but that's why we, we, we went 70 and 12, didn't get coached of the year. Kind, we kind of got played. But anyways, we finished nine games in front of OKC, but they got the award. And we killed in anybody in the East. As far as the stats go, Kobe averaged 28 points a game, seven assists. Carmelo averaged 20 points, seven rebounds, five assists. CP3, 18 points, nine assists, you know, three steals. D12, 11 points. Yo, our stars... Our stars were putting up numbers, and we had a solid bench, too. <laughs> Our number three pick did not even play like that. But let's see if we can actually win this thing in the NBA playoffs. Because like I said, y'all, the, the regular season don't mean anything. But up against the Denver Nuggets in round one, we should sweep them. We were killing this NBA season, an easy sweep for them. Up against the Jazz. Do, do they still have Darren Williams, or is... I, I, I don't know. Maybe he's, maybe he's on the Mavericks right now. Who knows? But let's see look who's on their team. Derek Favors. Bye, guys. Bye. I, I don't even know how y'all made it here. But bye. They yeah, somehow took a game from us up against the Hornets. Not the Pelicans, the Hornets. Anthony Davis is not, he's not a superstar yet. They got the, okay, their front court is nasty. Even with Gortat, it's, it's nasty. But the back court? Eh. I think that we should be able to sweep them too. Let's see. And we go ahead and we sweep them too. Up against the Miami Heat, the true matchup. A Kobe and LeBron NBA Finals. Something that we really wanted to see, but we never got to see in real life. That Heat team is some serious though. I ain't gonna lie. Last we got lucky in lost in round one. But they got LeBron 99 overall. D Wade, Chris Bosch, Jalen, Jalen Brown, okay. But other than that, this team is really garbage. I'm 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 not gonna front. This team is really bad after that. <laughs> so let's see if we can actually beat them two as we take game one. They take game two. We take game three. Bye. Never mind. So we go ahead and we win the NBA championship in six. And we do go back to back. Kobe Bryant now has seven NBA championships with an average of 30 points, seven assists. And he is finals MVP, shooting 66% from the field. But anyways, hope you guys did enjoy this video. And like I said before, if you guys did, make sure to go ahead and slap that like button. Yo, use a hammer and beat the heck out of that like button. And sh just show that love and show that support. I appreciate all y'all support. This stuff is messed up. He has seven NBA championships if this was to happen. Seven. So basically, I'm going to say this. And this, this may be why. If Chris Paul would have joined and the NBA did, did not veto that trade, I believe Kobe Bryant would have had a shot. I'm not going to say he would have got it. He would have had at least a decent shot at winning some more NBA championships. And he probably would have never have gotten hurt. And his in the end of his career would not have been as bad as it was. But let me know y'all's thought on that. Do you guys agree with me? Do you guys think I'm wrong? Let me know y'all's opinion in the comment section below. But this is our final roster. Kobe Bryant, Carmelo Anthony, Chris Paul, Dwight Howard, Al Jefferson, OJ Mayo, Giannis, Aaron Baines, Tony Allen, Marcus Smart. Kevin Serpin, Trevor Ariza, and Raymond Felton. And before anything, let me show you guys my settings real quick. You guys like to, you know, be on that stuff. Here you go. But anyways, hope you guys did enjoy this video.
But other than that, y'all, it's your boy Legendary EA. Let me know y'all's thoughts on what I said earlier. And make sure to go ahead and like this video. And if you guys are not subscribed, please join Team EA. It's lit over here. Join Team EA. And you guys will be in for the best experience. But other than that, join Notification Squad too. And let me know which rebuild you guys want to see next on this channel. But it's going to be fire. Just let me know which year, which roster. Let me know what you guys want me to do. And like I said at the beginning, tweet me on Twitter what you guys got for Christmas and I hope you guys had a and I hope you guys had a great one and have a blessed day today. But other than that y'all it's your boy legendary EA turn up and I'm out. That was so random. I'm out peace y'all. You know I'm independent get the rental bus a jug. You know that purple rain had them hitters on foot. I see you acting strange I can tell it's ain't love. That brand new move saying had to get it